everyone, it's Jen. Welcome back to Yarn Purpose. Today, let's try the Addy Turbo Sock Wonder Knitting Needles. Hey everyone, it's Jen. Welcome back to Yarn Purpose. I'm super excited because I have yet another set of knitting needles to try that are perfect for sock knitting for you. Everyone seemed to really enjoy the Addy Flexi Flips video I did a while back and I'll link to that down below. Um, but now I have these Addy Turbo Sock Wonder needles to try for you. So once again, my friend Jennifer, who's Knitting Quilter on Instagram, she's the one that finds everything cool, I swear, when it comes to knitting. She's always telling me about the new coolest thing or you know, somebody's using some needle no, no, none of us have heard of before. Um, so I had not heard of these. I had not heard of the Sock Wonder Needle. Um, so she purchased them and then once again I borrowed them to try them out and then do a video for you guys. And once again I will say it's the perfect thing if you do like trying new tools and you don't necessarily want to spend the money on tools. That is part of the reason I love my knitting group is I find lots of great stuff and plus we kind of share things so we can try things out. What I have here is a US size 1 10 inch circular needle. This needle is 10 inches from tip to tip. So it's just an Addy Turbo circular needle that is 10 inches total in length. What you will notice here though, that makes it good for the sock knitting, is that the tips are two different lengths. So the longer tip here is 2.75 inches and then the shorter tip here is 1.75 inches. And what you are supposed to do is put the longer tip into your right hand and the shorter tip into your left hand while you're knitting. So it does not matter if which hand you use to hold your yarn. So it doesn't matter if you knit continental or you knit English, it does not matter. You are still gonna have the longer needle in your right hand. If you are truly a left-handed knitter and that you knit completely the opposite way as a right-handed knitter, you are truly a left-handed knitter, not that you're just left-handed, then you would hold the longer needle in your left hand. But for the vast majority of people, we all knit right-handed, whether you're left-handed or right-handed. Um, so you're going to hold the longer needle in your right hand. So again, they have the Addy Turbo tips on there. So, you know, they're not the sharpest tips. I do like sharp tips on my knitting needles. Um, you know, but these Addy Turbos, they'll, they'll get the job done. So, now that I've told you a little bit about the needle, let's go ahead and give them a try. So I have my sock on the Sock Wonder needle. You can see here that I have the longer tip on the right side, so that'll be going in my right hand, and then the shorter tip on the left side, so that will be going in my left hand. So all we gotta do now is just start knitting. One thing I like about these needles is that you can just keep going around and around and around and around and you never have to stop and really readjust your sock. So if you're using, you know, double pointed needles or a longer circular needle, whether you're using two circulars or doing uh, one long circular for the magic loop method, you know, you're always having to stop at some point to rearrange your, your needles. You know, you have to move to the next needle or you have to with magic loop, you know, pull the cord so you can you can move to the next needle. So what I like about this is that I don't have to worry about any of that. I can just keep going around and around and around and around. As I was playing with these needles, I found that for me, I'm sort of having the same issue that I did with the flexi flips in that I just need to figure out sort of the right way to hold them for my style of knitting. And I said it before in the Flexi Flips video that everybody, you know, knits a little bit different. Everybody holds their needles differently. Um, so, you know, really when trying these new needles, it's about finding the right way to hold them that's right for you. So I said this before too, that when I'm knitting, especially socks, I have a tendency to like really grab on for dear life to my needles, especially my pinky. I really kind of crank down on the double pointed needle or the end of um, the needle if it's magic loop. Uh, you know, so here with these needles being so, so short, the tips being so, so short, you don't really have that option. 
So I'm finding that almost just a lighter hand, if that makes sense, like really not trying to crank down on it like I normally do, just hold it a little bit lighter, more loose, almost pinching it more, that that seems to be helping a little bit with, um, with, you, with using these needles. For me, the other thing too is that when I'm knitting socks, especially this type of sock where it's just a plain stockinette sock, I'm using you know beautiful hand dyed striped yarn here. For me, the name of the game is speed. So I really do want my sock knitting to go fast. So I do think that this is something with a little more practice I could get faster at. Um, I don't know if it'll ever be as fast as Magic Loop or Double Points for me, um, but I do see where with a little bit of practice, you could you could get going pretty fast with the with this little needle. And again, um, because you don't have to keep switching needle configurations um, to move to the next needle, I, I could see where this could be a very speedy way to to knit your socks. Yeah, my one main problem is that I keep slipping the stitch from the left needle to the right needle and not knitting it. But I think that that just might be a matter of figuring out how to configure the needle a little bit better. Um, you know, because the stitches do get sort of bunched up around here, so I think I just need to be a little more careful with how they're getting bunched up so I'm not knitting. I think the problem is I'm knitting kind of far down on this on the right needle, so I think if I can just keep it a little bit closer to the tip that I would stop having that problem. Again, it's just going to be a little more practice. I did spend some time knitting uh, with these needles, but you know, probably after you got through a whole pair of socks with these, you know, you would, you would get the hang of it and it would start to become much faster. That was just a few stitches using the Addy Sock Wonder needle. So now I will go back and give you my final thoughts on these sock knitting needles. Okay, so you see I kind of struggled through it, but I did get the hang of it. I will say that I like these more than those Addy Flexi Flips that I tried a while back. I do think that with a little practice, I actually could get pretty fast at using these. Um, I do like that you never had to reconfigure your needles. I know I said that a couple times in the in the video in the clip of me knitting, but I do really like that you could just keep going around and around and around and around. I think once I could kind of figure out sort of the right distance to have my stitches sort of, you know, coming around on the on the circular and stuff so I wouldn't have that problem with like I felt like I was knitting like further down here but again it's just like anything it's gonna take practice um, so I I don't know I do feel like with a little more practice um, I would try these again I don't know I might buy I might I might buy a pair for myself and uh, actually try to knit a whole pair of socks on them it, they these were fun to try and like I said I personally did prefer these to the Addy Flexi flips um, I'm sort of magic loop sock knitter and sort of getting back into doing double pointed needles for my socks. Um, you know, I don't think I'm going to start knitting all of my socks this way, but I would try to knit a whole pair of socks on these. I like them enough that I would try. Um, but if you have tried small circumference circulars, I would love to hear about your experience in the comments below. Um, you know, I, like I always say, I'm always curious about how people knit, what they like to knit with. I just like to know about all the knitting things. So if you have tried specifically these needles or even small circumference, nine inch circulars, 10 inch circulars to knit your socks, I would love to hear about your experiences. So that's it for me for today. If you liked this video, go ahead and give it that thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more videos from me, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. If you like, you can turn on the notifications to be notified whenever I upload a new video. I hope everybody has a great week and I'll be back very soon with another video. Bye.